hello 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 welcome back everybody welcome back to my channel i'm not going to scream because i think someone made a reference to, the, to that my value of my voice anyway today is june 28th 2020 i was supposed to say 2002 i don't know anyway my name is rosette no, it's Rosie Rosette 2020. That's the name of this channel. Anyway, so today we are going to review B Bella Cosmetics. And actually, I got this, I think I got this palette from a beauty bag, which that was the only thing that I ever got from them. Like usually a subscription, you know, they they continue to send you things every month, but this is the only thing. I'm wondering, did I cancel or did, was it enough, wasn't enough money or something? I don't know. But anyway, this is the actual, and you know what? This is the actual palette. It doesn't come with a mirror, but that's okay because I have mirrors. But it does help when it does have one. But I, I think that um, increases the cost I would imagine so so this is it this is what it is and you know what I know I reviewed it briefly when I first got it but this is a review of me actually trying the products and you know what I absolutely like it this really reminds me of um, the palette that I've desperately been looking for so far with Morphe I think it's the 35O or the 35B Oh, and this says 35D, so maybe this is a knockoff of Morphe's. I'm not exactly sure, but I literally got this. I need to look up that uh, subscription thing because I got this entire palette plus, I think, um, a mascara and a primer and another eyeshadow, I think. For $14 you can't beat that and the thing about it is I was you know I was looking on some of the websites especially on Afterpay and like I think this goes for $25 just alone just for the makeup palette not for the you know the primer or whatever so all that being said um, these beauty subscriptions are well wor worth their money okay so that being said, I have a purple thing. I don't know where the sun is today. Usually it's like, oh, it's here it is. It's right there. But I think you can actually see my look without the sun. So I wanted a purple thing because I wanted to wear um, my purple hair today. I, I don't know what I'm going through. I'm 51 years old. And literally, I, at 50, at the end of my 50 realm, or air or whatever um, year I got into colored wigs and I absolutely loved them I ordered a whole bunch of like maybe seven or eight colored wigs from Amazon cheap colored wigs or whatever but literally the attention that I get and just the feeling you know just something new um, some outrageous this is a little darker so this one doesn't you know I don't know if this one flags as much attention, but I'm just saying it is what it is. Okay, so like I was saying, I wanted a purple thing. So I ended, I used this color for my eyebrows. I used this one, this one, this one, that one, you see. And that, this green really sticks out. And I really don't, I always do this and then I end up looking like a clown. You see how it's very, ooh, ooh. Uh oh I did the green the green I don't want to do the green okay let me see uh oh oh shoot darn it I gotta wear these pants today all right let me just see if I can if you can see if I can nope 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 I won't be able to do that you know what one day I will have to definitely do oh no you can see it you can see it i would have to definitely do not a tutorial because i'm not a teacher a try on okay yeah that's it because i'm far from a makeup artist or whatever okay so let's 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 test some of these this one was really nice 
I really did appreciate this one. This one literally was the best one to me in the whole palette, but that, you know, that being said. All right, so um, I did not, I did not use this black for some reason. I'm really kind of scared of black. I, I really need to um, start working on black shadows, different shades of black shadows. And you know what? I think I'll do that with the Jeff, the Jeffree Star cemented. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But it is what it is. Okay, so this is it. And um, okay, so let's get to the swatching because there's no numbers. And here are the purples that um, I did. Now these, they seem a little chalky, but yet they're pigmented enough to stay on. Like I really didn't have to hustle and tussle with um, these colors. Okay, so these are basically the colors that I have on my eyes. Do you see that? If you look on my Instagram account, which is Rosie Rosette 2020, you will actually see pictures of the finished look. Now these are those are not, you know, some photography where I, I have the ring light and you know a white background. No, it's basically in in daylight, hopefully. Yeah, or some of them I take in my garage. I'm not even gonna lie. I take in my garage because I like the lighting and the background. You know, it's almost like you're in a picture studio. So this is it. And you know what I like about it? It's pigmented enough to create a look, but it's not too pigmented where you have to literally like scrub <clears throat> the colors off of your eyes at night. I don't know if I'm going to have to scrub it, but what other? Oh, Profusion. I used Profusion yesterday, and that was the easiest takeoff ever. And it stayed on all day. Okay, so let's try the fuchsia. Let's try the pinks, honey, because you guys know I love my pinks. All right. Ooh, this one is real. Now, this one, I think I would have to scrub off because I barely touched I barely touched that color and look what it got. Oh my goodness. I'm glad that I had that experience. This is beautiful. This, I, I love this palette. I literally love this palette. I literally love this. I, I do. I do. Um, oh, I did use this pink. I did use this pink. Oh, that is a beautiful pink. Let's see if you can see it. Okay, let's see if we can see it on my arms. Oh, look, you see that red? That red is the most pigmented, that not red, fuchsia. Oh my God, I literally, I barely touched that. Oh my goodness. Now, I know that's the one that I will have to literally scrub off for dear life. See, look, they don't, they don't come, they don't seem that pigmented, but they are. They are very, let me get my trusted sock. Hey, sock, come through, sock. Okay. Now, let's do the greens and the blues. Let's do this blue. That one. Ooh, that's pretty. The green. Ooh, and this purple. I didn't even, for some reason, I didn't use this purple. Oh, yeah. It doesn't, literally, it doesn't swatch well. Do, oh, you know what? I put on lotion. After I took a shower, I put on lotion. So maybe this is the reason why. Or maybe it's the sunlight. There we go. There we go. Okay, now you can see it. You see that? Mm -hmm. This is a fabulous plate. I wish I would have ordered two of those subscription <laughs> boxes. So that, you know, for $14, that's like a savings. You know, I'm subscribed to BoxyCharm. And I wish they would send us some little cheap little, you know, not cheap. I'm not going to call it cheap because I don't know the, the, um, the cost of this. But, like, if they can send us one of these in the base box a month, I think it'll fit. It would definitely fit. I don't know why they don't do that. 
you know, at least once a year. But anyway, so this is the palette. Oh, you know what? There's two. There's actually two more that I want to try out. This yellow one. Oh, I love this one. This reminds me of Hawaii. If I had a makeup palette, which I have no problem doing, I would probably get this color and make it call it Hawaii. And I use this one. Oh, this one is very beautiful. Can you see? Okay. You see those two? Let me see if I can get it away. Huh. That shimmer is really beautiful. So I think it's one, two, three, four shimmers. Hey, is this a shimmer? Let's see if this is a shimmer. Oh, no, this is a matte. But um, this is a versatile palette. You have your, I mean, it has basically every color. You have a yellow, you have a green, you have purple, you have your pinks, you have your nudes, you have transitional shades this is i love this palette and i'm so happy that you know after using it i'm pleased with it because there's another brand that i ordered and they were expensive and i was not pleased and i'm very hurt because i hate to spend a lot of money and get duped then spend a little and be happy i guess everyone's like that but whatever okay so this is this is the palette this is the look this is the wig okay all right well thank you so much and I wanted to add let me put that right here this is Katie cat gloss by um, cover girl I think this is cover girl Cody Cosmetics. I think this is CoverGirl, but anyway, I got this on sale at Walgreens. And I noticed, but I don't think they have them anymore, so it's no use in reviewing it. But this is it right here. And then maybe you can get it online, but I like it. Okay, well, that is my synopsis of B Bella Cosmetics. Which I like. I like, I like, I like. I like Bella. Okay, you guys. I will talk to you later. Bye.